Hello guys. Welcome back to Health Wisdom YouTube channel. In this last video we knew about the how platelet count can be decreased in chronic hepatitis B patients gradually. If you have not seen this video, then please do watch it. We make videos with so much hard work, just so you know how to manage chronic hepatitis B infection. In this video we will discuss about how interferon alpha is working for hepatitis patients. Please watch this video till end. How interferon alpha works for HBB patient. Interferon alpha drugs are a class of medications like interferon A, interferon B, interferon G. Those medications are primarily work by modulating the immune system and inhibiting the growth of liver cells for hepatitis patients. Interferon alpha called IFN alpha is a cytokine, a type of signaling protein that helps the body fight off viruses and liver tumors or cancer tumors. Interferon alpha is basically binding to cells and triggering a cascade of events that interfere with viral replication also affect how cancer cells grow and spread. Interferon alpha binds to receptors on the surface of cells, triggering a signaling pathway that leads the production of proteins inhibit viral replication. These proteins can interfere with viral RNA and DNA synthesis, inhibit viral protein production, and even cause infected cells to self-destruct called apoptosis. Interferon alpha enhances the activity of immune cells like natural killer cells and T cells, which play a role in clearing viral infections. It is used in a variety of treatments, including certain forms of leukemia, malignant melanoma, lymphoma, hepatitis B, and hepatitis C. Interferon alpha treats chronic hepatitis B by helping fight against the virus and potentially leading to a sustained virologic response, even after treatment ends. Note. HBB-specific TNF-alpha producing CD4 T cells are associated with liver damage, while HBB-specific IFN gamma producing CD4 T cells are associated with viral clearance in patients with chronic HBB infection. Interferon alpha not only serves a vital role in modulating the immune system and inducing antiviral innate immune responses, but also serves as an important role in anti-tumor therapy for apoptosis. You have a question here, what is apoptosis? Apoptosis, a type of automatic of cell death, gradually it's developed and caused the dead cell of the liver. After that liver lost all the functions. But interferon alpha medications have some medicated compounds that can enhance the apoptosis condition. Similarly, interferon alpha LPHA2B decreases the synthesis of liver cholesterol and increases its secretion and promotes cell apoptosis. As we know, every action has its reaction. Interferon alpha drugs also have some side effects, including flu-like symptoms, fatigue, depression, and changes in blood counts. If you are a hepatitis patient and taking interferon's medications for functional cure, touch with your doctor regularly and share with your doctor how your body's response to interferon alpha 2B. Follow the directions on your prescription label carefully and use interferon alpha 2B injection exactly as directed. Do not use more or less of this medication or use it more often or for a longer period of times 
which is prescribed by your doctor. Your doctor may decrease your dose if you experience serious side effects of the medication. Be sure to tell your doctor how you are feeling during your treatment period. It will take long time you need to keep patience for that. Never reuse syringes, needles, use new disposal syringes and needles every time. Suppose, if you miss a dose of interferon alpha 2b injection, inject your next dose as soon as you remember or are able to give it. Do not use medication two days in a row. Do not inject a double dose to make up for a missed dose. If you miss a dose, consult your doctor and have questions about what to do. Are you taking any antiviral medicine? If yes, for how long have you been taking it and what side effects are you facing? Please share in the comment box. If you like this video, please like and share this video more and more. Please support our channel. Thanks for watching Health Wisdom. We will meet you with a new update in the next video.